Testing. Testing. All right, I think we are good to go. So, don't mind me, I'm just scrolling down our handy dandy cheat -che sheet. So that I can cheat should the situation demand it. Speaking of cheating, uh. Okay, I guess we can't clean up. Hold on, let me check something real quick. There we go. Right. That's creepy. Seems like it. So now we sleep. Are we velvet rooming again? Welcome to the Velvet Room. So I wonder, is this going to be the explanation of confidence or of persona fusion? Probably not fusion. I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? Yeah. Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. The goal of your rehabilitation is to thwart the fated ruin. However, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. Mm. Today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, did you not? You mean Ryuji? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. Oof. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, stuff. lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you doesn't. You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Yep, this is confidence. Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself, or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> we have a deal then. Wait, is there an Igor confidant? I don't remember that. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the fool persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. 
I thought the fool was the phantom thieves. But maybe it's different this time. Oh no, this does make sense. Continue devoting yourself to your rehabilitation. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate. So the 13th is How all annoying. automatic stuff. We barely started high school and already they're making us play at a volleyball rally? What does the auto advance do? And why are they like I pushed the, the button and it doesn't do anything. Kamoshida's gonna crush us. We get to see his technique live and in person, though. We should totally get spiked on. Yeah, okay. You're gonna get your face smashed in. <sighs> Just look at how banged up the volleyball team is. What the hell goes on during their practices? Kid's not looking too good. Still sticks out. Hasn't changed a bit. Hmm? Ah, pretty boring. Right? They're just gonna like assholes acting like a king over here too. Resume the match after all that. We get to know each other better, my ass. It's just a one-man show for him to stroke his ego. Oh, oh, and how he acted like he was worried about Mishima. Oh, what an abusive D-bag. <clears throat> well, anyways, now's our chance to go look for the guys we saw were slaves yesterday. Let's look for the faces we saw at the castle. All the members of the team should be here today. I'll be sure to find someone to spill about Kamoshida's physical abuse. Just you wait, asshole. The Where first are you one searching? that popped out was a guy from Class D. So let's start from there. That's your class. Hopefully you can get him to talk without any issues. People have been avoiding me lately, so... Oh, but you're kind of in the same boat, huh? Ooh, quick travel. That sounds very convenient. So is the red pin... I assume that's like places we have to go? It's either places we have to go or where it's going to drop us.
go. So we're a second year in class D, so this should be the guy, right? What? Are you skipping out on the volleyball rally? I guess I expect it from you, Transfer. Hey, that's the guy who was over at that castle. You too, Sakamoto? What do you guys want? How'd you it's get from injured? Practice. What does that have to do with anything? Kamoshida did it to you, right? Look, I ain't gonna tell anyone you squealed. Just tell us about how Kamoshida's abusing you. I... I don't know what you're talking about. Are you not. afraid? You guys are talking complete nonsense. Don't try and hide it. We already know. You know? You have proof. Well, uh... I... This is ridiculous. Please, leave me alone. You're really bothering me. <sighs> All right, that's enough. Come on, let's go. That injury ain't normal, and she still won't fess up. Crap, if we keep going at this pace, the ball game's gonna end. Let's pull up. Be faster. I'll check the practice building for people before clubs start. You handle the classroom building. I think we just adjust slightly. So I'm gonna better. There, now I'm front and center. There's a third year on the volleyball team that I remember. I think he's in 3C. He was getting beat pretty badly at the castle. He might have some injuries here too. Anyways, I'll hit you up if I find anything. See ya. So 3C. Was that a Risei's voice actor I just heard? Three. Did he say? Oh, the rooms go by like school year, not floor number. Learning something new. It's a 3B, 3C. He refused. First year, new member. Oh, you look injured. What are those injuries? Special I can't coaching. Do it. you like how you were late the other day was a lie and all 
There's that weird rumor about you, too. What do you want with him? Right back at you. You're not even in our class. We just happen to get to know each other. What are you planning on doing to Mr. Kamoshida? Huh? I see. I get ya. You're all buddy-buddy with Kamoshida after all. This has nothing to do with you, Sakamoto. If you found out what he's been doing behind your back, you'd dump him right away. Behind my back? What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> you wouldn't get it. Anyway, people are already yeah, that's talking a about bold you. assumption that she wouldn't understand that the abuse of the volleyball team is a problem. I don't know what you're trying to pull, but no one's gonna help you. I'm warning you, just in case. That's all. Why she gotta be so aggressive all the time? You know her? We just went to the same middle school. Anyways, that's not what we're here to talk about. I had no luck on my end. What about you? Did anything like someone's name turn up? Uh, Nishima? Huh? Special coaching, huh? True. I always see the guy covered in bruises. Let's go talk to him before he leaves then. A second Sakamoto and you too come on we just want to chat Kamoshida has been coaching you huh you sure it's not just physical abuse certainly not what are you talking about Ryuji you for? gotta work Anyways. on your like subtlety <laughs> tactfulness approaching the subject indirectly <laughs> spike you today right in the face that was just because I'm not good at the sport still that doesn't explain all the other bruises you've got they're from practice is he forcing you to keep quiet that's what's going on here Mishima isn't it time for practice uh, I'm not feeling well today what Maybe you're better off quitting then. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from this school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? Ooh, I like the shade on that. Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. This won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. That asshole. He's gonna pay for this. There's no point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. Principal, your parents, they all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has got to be a joke. Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you, of all people, know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. What now? Try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's all I can do. I forget how we like get back to doing stuff in the castle.
head to sleep soon. I just also want to check confidant. Did we get any like skills from this? Okay, no, it just says next ability punk talk. I assume that's his version of like you can talk to uh, the the people who do things. Something along those lines. Because volleyball. Who are you talking about? On. So now we sleep again. I swear we're almost getting to <laughs> gameplay. <laughs> So we're gonna talk to An maybe. Shouldn't you be heading to volleyball? Uh-huh. That bruise above your eye. Is that from practice too? Y yeah. Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job, I think. I should get going. Shiho. Are you sure you're okay? Uh-huh. Yes. T today won't work. I'm... I'm not feeling so good. Sorry. Bye. Hey, wasn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Come on, dude. You can't go after Kamashita's bitch. <sighs> what? Uh, oh, I'm in the way, aren't I? Sorry. Are you hurt? Huh? Um, well... Hmm. You don't look familiar. Could you be that transfer student from Class D? Um, this might not be any of my business, but don't let the rumors get to you, okay? They don't bother me. I'm glad to hear that. My best friend is often misunderstood too, all because of her looks. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to drag on like that. Anyway, I have to go to practice. I'll see you around. Damn it! The hell? Did you find someone? <sighs> Is that what it looks like? All of them kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. 
Kamoshida had to have told him something. At this rate, it looks like we'll have to go to him directly. There's no point. I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. Can you think of anything? Uh, I guess oh, a sneak attack. If we could do it without getting caught, but if we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? The so cops? you want to tell them about the castle? They'd never believe us. <sighs> Have any? What do we do? The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to? I finally found you. You say something. Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. That voice. Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day? The cat's talking? I am not a cat. This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our world? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. That aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this too? Yeah. Then it really is Morgana. You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm? I heard you mention something about witnesses. Oh, shut up! You know, I could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? Quiet down! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? Uh, make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Just... Looks like it. What the hell's going on? Anyways, so we hear a talking cat, earlier, they just hear meows. Quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be just small enough to fit. Hey, how dare you treat me like... <laughs> Don't be so rough with me. Enough of that. You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So, if that castle were no more... His desires would go too. Precisely. You sure pick up things fast. Now that does sound a tad morbid. For real? Like, He's gonna turn good? you can rob someone of all of their desires? Like, that's great when the desires are obviously bad. But as they are with really everybody in this game. But... Erasing a palace essentially uh, means forcing the I can, owner I can to see that going a bad way, too. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes, and he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. 
Not only will we be able to bring Kamashita down, but there won't even be a trace of our involvement. That's amazing! You are one incredible cat! True. Except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. Stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable secret plan, after all. If you want to help me out, I'll gladly teach you. What's your call? Our luck's running dry looking for witnesses. I guess we have no choice but to go along. Yep. Good. Oh, right. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love, those sorts of things. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die! Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Now hold up. <laughs> I get what they're going for here. And no one does die, as far as I remember from last time I played this. However... <laughs> This seems like a very calloused response to the question of is doing like extrajudicial vigilante murder a problem? Hey, what do you think? I don't want to kill him. Of course not. Sheesh. I come all this way and this is what I get. It's not like anyone will ever find out. not the point thank you <laughs> if we just go around secretly doing whatever we want we'd be no better than that effing kamashita there we go uh, isn't this ryuji master philosopher i'll come back later make sure you've made your decision by then man we're getting all worked up for nothing damn it i'll try and see if i can figure out another way come on Let's get out of here. What do you mean? Oh, that was a little weird. Uh, I guess it makes sense. Like, the train was leaving, and now it's... They had to show it coming again.
Okay, I mean, so far they're all just talking about... Oh, can we just fast travel to... That's convenient. Will you please give it a rest? I told you, I'm not feeling up to it. Wait, what? That's not what you promised. Can you call yourself a teacher? This has nothing to do with Shiho. Uh, <sighs> Shiho's starting position. Wait, were you listening? Not on purpose. Haven't you heard of privacy? Haven't you heard of not taking a personal call loudly in public at a train station? <laughs> like, I'm normally Mr. Privacy, but that's kind of like, can you blame people for overhearing? No, I was out of line. Sorry. So, how much did you hear? You were arguing. See, that is true. It's nothing at all. Nothing. Uh, actually, following someone is quite rude, but for the sake of the story, we will follow along. Stop following me. Are you okay? Why do you keep worrying about me? <laughs> What the heck? I really don't get you. I don't have anything to talk about with you. It was just an argument. With the teacher? You heard every last word then. You've heard the rumors, haven't you? About Mr. Kamoshida. Everyone says we're getting it on. But that's so not true. <laughs> now is him on the other line. I avoided giving him my number for the longest time. He told me to go to his place after this. You know what it means. I turn him down, he said he'd take my friend off as a regular on the team. I've been telling myself this is all for Shiho's sake. I can't take it anymore. Uh, uh. I've had enough of this. I hate him. But still, Shiho's my best friend. She's all I have left in that sorry excuse of a school. Tell me, what should I do? Have you contemplated Sorry. the murder of his <laughs> alter ego? <laughs> it's not your problem. Because that is apparently the line we're going with. What? What am I saying? I barely even talked to you before. Maybe that's why. <laughs> you might be right. You're so weird. Usually everyone just ignores me. Are you really a bad person? I've heard people talking about you, but I just don't see it. 
I'm bad to the bone. <laughs> Is that supposed to be a joke? Kinda had a feeling they were all just exaggerations. You seemed lonely. Almost like you didn't belong anywhere. You're the same in that regard. Maybe that's why it was so easy for me to talk to you. Is there really no way for me to help Shio? I wish he'd just change his mind. Like, forget about me and everything. As if something like that would ever happen. It could happen. <laughs> I wasn't asking for a serious response. But I do feel a bit better now. I'm gonna head home. Don't tell anyone what I told you, okay? I'll try and think of a way to persuade Kamoshida. Well, thanks. Zui, are you leaving? What is it? Mr. Kamashita's asking for you. He's in the PE faculty office. What did he say? I don't know. Well, I have to go. supposed to be an excuse how directionally challenged can you be by the way you haven't been hanging around any bad influences have you I actually made a friend huh. well, they've got to be pretty strange to want to spend time with you just make sure you're careful who your friends are you don't want them ruining your life Ooh, look at the time Seriously, think about how I feel having to stay up here waiting for you. Hey, I'm leaving. In the future, try not to come back so damn late. Understood? Loud and clear, Sojiro. Yeah, it's too much. And so now we sleep. And at the 15th. Oh, we are so close to having gameplay. I assume all of you know about the separation of powers. There are three branches in our government. The National Diet is legislative, the Cabinet is executive, and the Supreme Court is judiciary. Is that... I think that's one of the, like... I recognize this voice actor from the Naruto dub specifically. I'm trying to place whose voice this is. This division of power provides checks and balances, which ensures no one branch becomes unstoppable. I think he's like Kido Maru from the like sound ninjas in Naruto. Like the spider guy. Have you made up your mind? 
No matter how much thinking you do, there's only one option. You'd be better off just listening to me. Hmm, did I just hear a cat just now? That rumored cat be somewhere nearby. Settle down! Shout out to the guy sitting behind us. Not <laughs> snitching. Are you cutting class? If you only knew I'm reading this too. What's that? Enough! This is a classroom! Wait. She's going to jump! Suzui? Shiho? For real? Come on, let's go. Hey! Stay in your seats! Do not step foot outside of this room! No way! Oh yeah, fair warning. This next part might be a little upsetting to some people. Uh -oh. It's so interesting they don't let us uh, fast travel in this section. There's no way we're gonna get past all these goddamn people. Come on, let's try going through the. Okay, we can't dash on the other world. Good to know. Let me through, man. Please. Charge of her class, though. We should leave this to Principal Kobayakawa. I'll go. Please hurry. Shio. Why? Mon, I'm sorry. I can't take this anymore. Shio. Huh? Kamoshida? No! Shio! Did you see that? Uh, Her leg was totally bent the wrong way! It's not good for the world! She just blew herself off! Volleyball team! Return to your classrooms at once! <gasps> that guy... Hey, wasn't Mishima acting weird? He knows something. We're gonna make him talk this time. Ryuji, we gotta work on that Teachers, attitude. Return to your classrooms for the time being. Please do not let any students go home yet. Ah, that hurts. Why'd you run like that, huh? I didn't run. She jumped and tried to kill herself. Leave me alone. Do you know something? He's right. We ain't trying to get you busted. We won't say you talked either. Suzui. She was called out by Mr. Kamashita. Wait, what? I was called by him a number of times too. To the teacher's room. It wasn't just me or Suzui either. 
He'd nominate someone when he was in a bad mood and hit them. So the physical punishment thing was for real. Yesterday, he called Suzui out of the blue. She didn't make any mistakes or anything. Mr. Kamashita seemed really irritated that day. So it must have been worse than usual. He didn't. That son of a bitch! Uh. I bet Sakamoto's going to find Mr. Kamashita. Mr. Kamashita's probably in the PE faculty office on the second floor. I keep thinking I can run. He went into the PE faculty office. Huh? You bastard! The hell did you do to that girl? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb with me! That is enough! What you did was in coaching. What did you say? You, you ordered me to call Suzui here. I can only imagine what you did to her. You're going on and on about things you have no proof of. Basically, you're simply making these claims because you can't be a regular on the team, right? That's not what this is about. Even if it is exactly as you imagine it to be, hypothetically speaking, what can you do? We just received a call from the hospital. Suzui's in a coma, and her chances of recovery are slim. How would someone like that make a statement? There's no chance of her getting better, I hear. Oh, the poor girl. No. I can't be. God damn! This again? Does this mean we need to have yet another case of self-defense? You shut your mouth, you son of a bitch! Why are you stopping me? Don't let him get but to you. Still. Oh, you're stopping him? What a surprise. There's no need to hold back. Why not attack me? Oh, you can. <laughs> but of course you can. Everyone present right now will be expelled. I'm reporting all of you at the next board meeting. What? You can't make a decision like that. Who would seriously consider what scum like you say? You threaten me too, Mishima. So you're just as responsible. Huh? To think you didn't know why I kept someone as talentless as you on the team. You act like you're a victim. But you leaked his criminal records, didn't you? It's all over the internet, correct? How terrible. Mishima? He told me to do it. I had no choice. <laughs> now, are we finished here? You're all expelled. You're done for. Your futures are mine to take. Now get out of my sight. I can't believe this asshole's getting away with this. Huh? Oh, right. We have that. Huh? Have you lost your minds? You worthless kids aren't making any sense. But sure, go ahead and try. After all, you'll have plenty of time to kill until expulsion. We can't waste any time. We gotta hurry up and go to that world and beat the shit out of that asshole. We're not beating him up. We're simply stealing his distorted desires. Can I assume that you've made up your minds about this? About how he might suffer a mental shutdown? Someone almost died because of him. I don't give a rat's ass what happens to him anymore. And you? There's no other way is how I would it. put this. By the way, 
getting rid of a palace hard? You've tried it before, right? When did I ever say that? Huh? What? Were you just pretending to know? Is it true that you're getting expelled? Everyone's talking about it. That asshole's at it again. So you came all this way to tell us that? If you're going to deal with Kamoshida, let me in on it too. Hmm. You can't just sit back and do nothing after what happened to Shiho. This has nothing to do with you. Don't butt your head into this. Hmm. But it does! Shiho's my... I said don't get in our way! That was harsh. We can't take her somewhere like that. I hope she doesn't do anything too crazy. Oh, I don't know, like, follow us anyway and render the idea of Men trying to keep her out of it a moot times. point? We just gotta hurry up and deal with Kamoshida. Let's go already! The moment we cross over, we'll treat each other like phantom thieves. So I hope you're ready. Huh? Phantom thieves? Those who covertly sneak in and stylishly steal treasure. That is what we become. <laughs> that sounds kind of cool. So we just gotta say the school, Kamoshida's name, and castle. Then we end up in Bizarro World. How the hell's all this work? Someone make it? Of course. <laughs> That's kind of creepy, but uh I mean someone had to make it, right? Enough. We'll show that F in Kamoshida. Let's go. They really are going to do something. They're doing something on their phone? The name the school? Huh? Time to bust on through! What is this? T Tsukamaki? <gasps> that voice! Sakamoto? And are you. Wh why are you here? How should I know? What's going on? Hey, where are we? Hey, Isn't Evac. This school? I see. Perhaps she was dragged in because of that app thing. If multiple people can enter with the person who uses it, it stands to reason it'll pull anyone nearby. For real? Wait. So this is related to Kamoshida? You would think that, like... I don't know, I guess they'd be more careful that she wasn't following them after that whole situation they just had, but... Anyways, you gotta leave! I don't know. No! The shadows are going to find us if you make a scene. You better explain what's going on. I won't leave until you do. <sighs> Looks like we gotta force her. But how are we supposed to do that? Just take her back to where we came in. That's how it worked last time, right? Uh, oh, yeah. Can you lend me a hand? I feel bad about this. We can't deal with Kamoshida if we don't. We'll explain after everything's over. Hey! And just where are you touching? Whoa, sorry, I didn't mean... That's not important. You guys, seriously? Ah! <sighs> we better be careful from now on when we use that app. You should have checked the tools you used. 
Why do I, the one who was just watching, know more about it than you two? Shut up. Ah, jeez. Takamaki found out right when we were starting off. We gotta deal with this fast. That girl's name is An Takamaki, right? Lady An. The shadows have noticed us. You better brace yourselves, got it? We're counting on you, Joker. Joker? Not a nickname? Don't refer to it in such a lame way. It's a code name. What kind of stupid phantom thief would use their real name? I'm not down for that. And there's no telling what kind of effect yelling our real names will have on the palace. It's just a precaution. So, uh, why is he Joker? Because he's our trump card when it comes to fighting strength. Oh, that's kind of embarrassing, but we'll roll with it. You're Joker. It ain't too bad, yeah? I mean, technically, I think a better word for it would be like ace or something. Just because we don't, have, at least, I can't think of that many card games that like most US based like players would be familiar with that use the Joker as a trump card in that way. Like when I think of it, I usually think of like blackjack or poker or something where like the ace is the best card. Next up is you, Ryuji. You'll be, let's see, thug. Are you picking a fight with me? Yeah, I'll choose it myself. <laughs> when it comes to me, it's gotta be this mask. Honestly, I actually kind of like it. What if we named me after this? Fine. Why not Skull then? Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> I'm Skull! What do we do about this one's code name? Uh, what do you think? How about Mona? Well, if Joker thinks it's easier to call me that, then I'll go with it. All right. From here on out, we are Joker, Skull, and I mean, Mona. does Morgana even really need a code name? Like, if the stated reason is that, like, using our real names could have an impact, presumably that's because the people in the real world might know who we are. But no one in the real world is going to know Morgana because Morgana is a cat that is just a regular cat to everybody who hasn't like been in here. We need here. to be absolutely thorough about using those code names from now on. All right, time to go steal this treasure thing. Let's make a dash for it. I assume we would just want to go in through here again. Yeah. Praise be to King Kamashida. Death to the intruders. Hey, look, ain't that those intruders the other day were quite entertaining. However, I can't allow that trash to ransack my castle. Strengthen the security, kill them on sight. I'll reward whoever brings me their heads. Praise be to King Kamashida! Death to the intruders! Hey Mona, can't we just beat the crap out of him and call it a day? Look at all those soldiers, idiot! It'd be suicide! And I'm sure you don't want a repeat of last time. Besides, don't you want him to confess his sins? There's no point beating him up. We need to steal his materialized desires. The treasure. Fine, uh, so where is it? It has to be somewhere in the depths of this castle. Let's infiltrate further in while he's out here. What?
Who are we gonna learn about you know recruitment I finally? And all out attacks? I'll teach you their practical use now. There's another use for holdups, besides simply defeating enemies. Shadows are beings born from people's hearts, so naturally they can talk too. In other words, you can communicate with them. Get it? If you talk to them when they're cornered, they might offer money or items since they don't want to die. In fact, talking has a better chance of scoring something great, as opposed to just offing them. Well then, let's do the first step. We're all locked down! That was incredible, Joker! I want an item. Well, something along those lines. Now, sorry. Well, wait, what? Oh, this isn't how I was planning this to go. Uh, if that's uh, for real. Sorry, but we're in a hurry. Just now, what happened? For real? Change to Pixie. Pixie, and we're gonna Zium. Is that the shadow from earlier? Don't tell me. Did you take in the shadow's appearance and powers as a persona? Persona! Rabbit trap! Girl, is she? <laughs> Besides that. the enemy's appearance and powers into his mask and made is such a feat even possible is this good of course it is only one heart exists per person so normally a person can only have one persona incredible that ability will give us a huge advantage in battle all right try to do that even more if the opportunity arises you better help out too skull hell yeah we'll hold every last one of them up I did see, I think there's a like mod that gives you really like a cheat sheet for those interactions. All. Maybe I should install that. We're still going to be on like a semi linear path. Ooh. Oh, crap. Uh, sorry, Evac. I'm actually not particularly interested in doing any 
updates to my branding or my graphics right now. attack here because we really want uh, the experience uh, we prefer to get the experience out of this Plant bomb. All right. It really seems like we should have more options for like sneaking. I'll reveal your true form. It does seem like guns are really crazy. To him. Yeah, fine. Give me a break. I got bad luck. How's that? Some more personas. Easy win. They were nothing. What do we have here? A oh. silver dagger. Alright. Oh wow, that's just like straight up better. Okay. Sakamoto said, and I ended up. Princess? Huh? Princess! Ah! Aren't there even more shadows here than before? Just getting this far has been a real pain in my ass. It's all because you guys provoked Kamoshida, you know. Still, he seems to be awfully on guard. Anyways, how are we supposed to steal that treasure thing? Don't be so hasty. First, we'll need to secure an infiltration route. A what? A path to the treasure's location. But honestly, I think we'll need a little more manpower in order to accomplish this. At the very least, one more person would be nice. Hey, you say you don't have your memories and all, but somehow you still know about that kind of stuff? Do you think this thing's really got him? I believe in Mona. At least you're a step above that moron. Oh, 
call me a moron. You sure talk big, but what if it turns out you're just some stray cat in the end? That can't be. Still, why was a princess in such an odd place? Princess? I could have sworn we were pursuing the readings of an intruder. It doesn't matter now. We must take her back to King Kamashita. Who's this princess they're talking about? Probably on. I should probably look into this. And yet another question goes unanswered. Stuff like the castle and that navigation app are mysterious, <laughs> but Morgana's got them both be. Eh, I wouldn't say. Remember, code names. Oh, crap, sorry. What was I again? Oh, yes, uh, Skull. <laughs> this is bad. That was fast. Your friend, Lady On. She's been taken by shadows. Wait, what? We sent her home earlier. If Lady On does indeed have the app, it could be possible. Oh, no. Don't tell me it got put on hers just like mine. Damn it! We let her out for her own safety and she just came back in by herself. Damn it! Okay, so we have not unlocked Persona Fusion yet. Yes! Okay, let's go. Castle, the world of my desires. What the? Wait, is this some red light district? What a lively slave. This isn't funny. Enough of the bullshit, Kamoshida. <laughs> the girls decided to tell me off. What do you think of that? Talking back is like totally unforgivable. In that case, she should be executed. <gasps> now then, how should I play with you? Shall I tear you into little pieces? Are you kidding me? This is effed up. Is that what he thinks of the girls on the volleyball team? Hey, that's... Takamaki! Just when I was about to start enjoying myself. What's the deal with this guy? You little... How many times are you gonna come back? I bet you just like those thieves. You came because you're pissed at me, huh? But, uh... Ah, I forget that chick's name. But it's your fault she jumped, you know. Huh? You were so reluctant to throw yourself onto me, that I had her take your place. You bastard! <laughs> no! Take one more step and I'll kill her on the spot. Damn it! Just sit back and enjoy the dismantlement show. No, don't! 
technically it's dismemberment. Maybe I actually don't know if that's true. I think. <laughs> You're such a perv. Hey, what are we gonna do? Takamaki. <laughs> Is this my punishment for what happened to Shio? That's more like it. You should have looked like this from the start. Shio. I'm so sorry. You're just going to listen to that? Huh? No. I don't want that. You're right. Letting this piece of shit toy with me. <laughs> What was I thinking? It's like I always say, slaves should just behave and... Shut up. I've had enough of this. You piss me off, you son of a bitch! My, it's taken far too long. Tell me, who is going to avenge her if you don't? Forgiving him was never the option. Such is the scream of the other you that dwells with me. I am thou, thou art I. We can finally forge a contract. I hear you, Carmen. You're right. No more holding back. <laughs> there you go. Nothing can be solved by restraining yourself. Understand? Then I'll gladly lend you my strength. <laughs> Cheap girl you can toy with, you scumbag. Bitch! You stole everything from Shiho. You destroyed her. Now it's your turn! I will rob you of everything! How dare you! Enough of your insolence! No, I've had enough of you! No one's gonna stop me now! Let's go, Carmen! How dare you deny King Kaboshida's love, you selfish lass! Pay for this insolence with your life! That dirtbag just sees women as sexual outlets! Don't make me laugh with that love bullshit! Come on, Carmen! Let's give him hell! Persona! Did it! They fall and flat! Uh, I assume if we try to get it to lend, it, lend us its power, it's just gonna be like, I'm the guard captain! Level up. Here, man. 
And more importantly, how? Hey, is that how you speak to a woman? Are you all right, Lady On? Lady On? Wait, what is this thing? Is it alive? How can it talk? And where in the world are we? D just calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Don't worry. How am I supposed to calm down? H huh? Why am I dressed like this? When did I... Uh, what's with this? How can you expect me to be calm? Well, I'm stumped. A search party will be coming for us soon. There's no time to explain. We don't have a choice. Let's retreat for now. We were just getting fired up and you had to go and get in the way. <sighs> Fine. Here, give me your arm. You take the other side. Thanks. Looks like we made it back. Hey, are you okay? Well, pretty much. Wait, I lied. I'm still confused about all of this. You may be safe now, but a lot sure did happen back there. At any rate, we stand out too much here. Let's relocate to a safer spot. Which one you want? Oh, we stand out too much in that secluded alleyway. So let's go to a very public train station. Whichever's not carbonated. Uh, they're both actually. Then... Here you go. What about me? Huh? But uh, you're a cat. <laughs> Have you calmed down, Lady On? Um, Morgana, right? I really am talking to a cat. This feels so strange. Oh, sorry. You're not a cat, right? It's only natural that you're confused. Demanding that you understand all of this right after what you went through is asking too much. Honestly, I still can't believe what happened. And that power. My persona. It's the will of your rebellion, Lady On. With it, you'll be able to fight in that other world. So if what you told me is true, we can make Kamoshida have a change of heart, right? Is it really possible? Can we actually force him to confess his crimes? The volleyball team's keeping quiet about this while teachers and parents turn a blind eye. If guys like us try and complain, they're just gonna shoot us down. Going all in on this plan is the only choice we got. Then let me help too. I want to make him pay for what happened to Shiho. He just keeps going like nothing happened, even after what he did to her. I'll never forgive him. Wait, did you just say, let me help? You mean you want us to take you along? Don't act like I'm going to drag you down. Weren't you watching? I can fight too. Hey, what should we do? She'll be great. I agree as well. We are lacking in manpower after all. Don't worry. I'll protect her. Even if you said no, I'd just go in alone. Ah, right. She can go by herself. I guess it'd be more dangerous turning her down. Ah. Uh... Then it's decided. Well, <laughs> I hope we get along. I'm going to make Kamoshida atone for what he did. Not just for Shiho's sake, but for everything he's done. I won't let any more people suffer because of him. I'll do whatever it takes. Another confidant. A group like yours must have relied on subtlety and misdirection. Otherwise, you'd never survive. 
Some of you might even have been hiding behind a public face their entire lives. If you're listening, then answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the lover's persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. know when you're heading back in oh wait we don't have each other's info hey give me your number and chat ID and um... I'll be counting on you then same goes for you Morgana the pleasure is all mine lady on what a kind girl such admirable consideration for others and the innocence to cast herself into the jaws of death to achieve her goal. Uh, I gotta say, I'm not looking forward to listening to Morgana simping for. She cares about her friends. A hundred plus hours of gameplay. What a girl! She's ca dude. You know, it'd be better if this group could get together quick from now on. True. Our best option would be to make a secret hideout where we could discuss these things. Hideout, huh? I like the sound of that. The school rooftop would work. It seems like nobody goes up there. For the time being, that will make the perfect hideout. I can't contact you from inside a palace, so I'll stay in this world. That being said, I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm personally nominating you. You should feel honored. This is all you. There's no way I can at my place. The train will be well, we now have our hideout, so let's meet there tomorrow. Okay, let's go look at my new residence for this world. Stay upstairs while we're open for business. Yes? Hey, Leo. Sorry if he was rude, Doctor. I don't mind. Come on, you're getting a... Thanks. I'll see you later. Come back again. <laughs> That's it for today. Oh, that customer just now? She's the head doctor over at that clinic down the street. Rumor has it she gives pretty crappy examinations and sells some weird homemade medicines on top of that. At least, that's what I've heard. I haven't been there myself. They should really just leave her alone. It's not like she's getting in the way of their lives. Hey, are we there yet? <sighs> well, I gotta get home and start making dinner. Place. Is this some kind of abandoned house? Hey, are you? I was wondering why I heard meowing. What did you bring it here for? It followed me here. Not my problem. Look, this place is a restaurant. Animals are a no-go. Though... I guess you might stay on good behavior if you've got a pet to take care of. Fine. But keep it quiet when we're open for business. And don't let it roam downstairs, or I'll toss it out. Oh, and I'm not going to take care of it. That's all on you. Was that the ruler of this place? He seemed pretty understanding for someone who keeps you cramped up in this dump. Then again... As opposed to normal people, I just sound like a meowing cat. Seriously, I had to keep calling out in that cute little voice. 
Make sure you wash that dish. By the way, uh, have you decided on a name? Morgana? Huh. I was hoping I'd get to name it. Looks like the chief likes me better than you. And to be honest, this place is heaven compared to Kamoshida's cells. Remember how you guys asked me before about what I am? To be honest, I don't remember anything about my birth. I mean, who does? I think the metaverse's distortions made me lose both my memories and my true form. It has to be. I mean, why else would a cat be able to talk like this? There's no other possible explanation. Actually, there's about a thousand possible explanations. There's no doubt that the distortions I mean, not according to, to my real self. The human world laws, but if we presuppose that ca this cat can really talk, they used to be human is by no means the only explanation that we have at this point. I'm sure that once they're purged, I'll finally be able to get that self back. And I have a pretty good idea on how to do it, too. That's why I was in the castle in the first place. Come to think of it, I didn't get hungry over in that world. Let me make myself clear. Your taking care of me won't be for nothing. It'll be give and take. Due to my knowledgeable and dexterous nature, I have a lot of intel on infiltration tools. What are those? Well, I can't tell you more unless we settle on a deal. In exchange for you keeping me here, I'll teach you about these tools. How does that sound? Let's do this. I like that answer. <laughs> then it's a deal. Skillful infiltrations and escapes to all manner of places. There's even the possibility that you use special tools and had someone who manufactured them. Answer me. I am thou. It shall become the wings with the birth of the magician persona. I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Ooh. All right. I'll lecture you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right. I'm going to stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strength born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills too. This is all part of our deal. Got it? I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? messages to each other with that thing, right? I want in too. So, I'm gonna have to ask you to type for me. Mm. Mm. Wow! Oh!
wearing Whoa. punk clothes. Attention! So if we up our proficiency, we'll dodge the Looks chalk. Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. Uh, just what come business? with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Actually. Hey! the clinic that the chief mentioned. Well, well I guess up. that's the only choice we have. We'll just have to go for it. Well. At LeBlanc. Head to the exam room. In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. I'm gonna prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Actually, I still need to restock those. So let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or. Uh, whichever? How about a stinky one then? Just kidding, there's no such pill. All right, why don't we stop beating around the bush? You're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me, hmm? That's right. You're one of those patients with an ulterior motive, huh? What's the world coming to? 
I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays, too. Huh. Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. But only medication that will help you recover your health. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest, and you don't look like you'll be any trouble. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by any time. That'll really help. Great. It's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? I wonder what you're going to use the medicine for. Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. Okay, which one? That should work. Here you go. Uh, let's see. You want that one? Thanks. That should work. Here you go. You want that one? Thanks. That should work. Here you go. Take care. Sounds to me like the doctor's got some problems. Seems no. sketchy. Okay. get our hands on some decent stuff if this store really has model guns. Well, we can leave that for tomorrow. Let's go. Everyone, wake up. This country is twisted. While Japanese society may appear to be thriving, many young people have not been as blessed as their elders. They have no jobs, no savings, no financial security whatsoever. These young people should be tackling their futures head on, but instead, they're too busy merely trying to survive. People give speeches all the time. Plus, politics are pretty boring anyways. can be pretty confusing to find sometimes. Hey! Yeah! 
This is exciting. Oh yeah, uh, before we head in, I guess we can just ask the guy behind the counter if we can't figure out. Looking for recommendations? I don't know, just buy whatever looks interesting to you. Ugh, some customer service. Fine, what do you want? An automatic? A revolver? Uh, automatic? Dude, why are you talking about cars now? Listen, this year's an enthusiast shop. My regulars will be mad if I let a casual like you hang around. Freaking casual. I bought shit from here like last week. Ah, can't remember you. You bastard. And you, looking for something? Something that looks real. Oh, you guys planning a nice big bank robbery or something? What? That ain't it. We just like how they look, is all. <laughs> Anyways, you should have said before you two are enthusiasts. I'm always up for helping fresh faces. Some precautions first, though. Don't go around pointing them at other people. Keep them in a bag or something if you're outside. Oh, and don't let the fuzz catch wind of you having them. I don't need them coming around here. We hate the cops. How about that? Me too. I like this guy. Now, if you look close, you'll be able to tell these are models. Real guns feel... different. Maybe someday I'll show you the real good stuff, though. If you got the guts for it, of course. But for now, you get the beginner selection. Just sit tight. I'll bring him out. <laughs> we did it, dude. We totally gotta go for some fancy shit, right? Oh, and here's the cash for mine. Kind of does seem right, like one? Uh, ranged weapons are just the way to go. Can I compare 10 extra damage That's for 2 choosing. less accuracy? I, I think we take that. Sounds good. Hmm, how's that? That's what you're choosing? Do you like it? that okay sell our old guns here? I guess not. Alright. Alright, which one? That's what you're choosing? Don't break it, okay? Hmm, that one, like it? That's what you chose that. Hmm, that's you better not use it to pull a prank. Okay, sounds good. That's what you're choosing, do I get? Uh, yeah, maxing out all our defensive stuff seems pretty good. Hmm, that don't break it, okay? That's what you're choosing. You better not use it to pull a prank. Mm, that will don't break it, okay? Uh, 
him again. Later. Did you hear? Apparently that subway driver from the accident was acting really odd during his testimony hearing. You talking about that psychotic whatever thing people are going on about? Yeah, I heard it completely alters your personality. The news is saying the driver couldn't even speak when they tried asking him questions. Only an idiot would believe a preposterous story like that. Oh, and sorry, but we're closing soon. How rude. This must be why you don't get many customers. Your coffee's actually not half bad. The beans must be lamenting the sorry state of this store. Thanks for stopping in. Please come again. Hm. I'm only trying to help you fix your business. Thanks for the coffee, at least. Jeez, what a pain. Oh, what do you want? If you're bored, go wash some dishes or something. How's business? Doesn't concern you. It's all good as long as the shop doesn't fail. I'm not gonna go wearing a fake smile. Is that a motto of yours? No, nothing like that. As long as I'm here, the world leaves me be. No annoyances or troublesome people to deal with. It's like my own personal hideaway. I'd be kind of screwed if I lost it. But I guess you would be too. So you better at least try and be useful around here. Anyway, I'm leaving now. Don't cause any trouble. Possibly implying he wants us to work at this little restaurant store thing. How was she? Just about ready to go to the palace. We just need to assemble some infiltration tools. Clean off that desk back there. That desk. Great. Now you can make things whenever you want. I'll provide the materials this time. Try making a lock pick. too hard about it. You'll get the hang of it. Honestly, crafting a go-home Everyone seems a little better, little but let's go ahead and do this. Great. Yeah. Ooh, proficiency boosting. Ready now. We're heading into the palace tomorrow. Good morning. Come on, hurry up and get to class. behavior won't do you any good once you're expelled okay so there actually is well that wraps up the homeroom period <clears throat> there's something I'd like to ask you it won't take long See, you're already getting on top of the problem I'd mentioned this morning, Miss Kawakami. I appreciate the support. Thank you again. Oh, you know this guy, Yoshizawa? Yes. He lent me a helping hand earlier. I recommend you steer clear of the likes of him if you have any consideration for your future. Remember the discussion we just had? 
There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh, the delinquent transfer student? Sorry to interrupt, but I need to use the guidance office. Oh, pardon me. We should be going too. Don't want to get in the way of guiding this delinquent and all. Please excuse us. <sighs> After you. I'm gonna get straight to the point. Did something happen between you and Mr. Kamushida? Why do you ask? Well, there was that little exchange just now, but that's not all. He gave me a brief lecture this morning, and your name came up. Something about the dangers of a lack of supervision. I don't mean to pry, but just make sure you don't go causing trouble, okay? Oh, and one more thing. That girl outside the office? You didn't make a pass at her, did you? Of course All not. right. Mr. Kamoshida has a real close eye on you. Apparently, you've been getting involved with Sakamoto-kun. You seem acquainted with Yoshizawa-san as well. Maybe you're just naturally drawn to athletes? Sorry, bad joke. That's all I wanted to discuss. You're free to go. So I believe we actually have control of our actions starting today. Would you like? So we need to check out Pirate Legend according to this. Here. Hmm. And we need to go to Shibuya. Underground Mall. It says we need to buy bio-nutrients. I assume that will be at the plant store? Recovery items from vending machines. And then we need to go to the second hand store. Uh, I believe we can just go to Yongenjaya. The 
we do not have a chariot persona because of last time. Hmm. Tobacco store. We want vending machines. Where are vending machines? <laughs> So it gets restocked every week, based on what they're saying there. How can I help you? So we need silk yarn and tin clasps. I'll go ahead and buy the DVD player too. Why not? Talk to to Kenny. Well, huh? I have my reasons. trying to do it's for brain power huh Take care. Can I work for it? What I'd be doing. <laughs> Did you change your mind? Bottoms up. <laughs> Good evening. Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. You eventually lost consciousness and fell back asleep. Are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. I'm not out of my mind. Fine. By the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. It produces a foul smell when it mixes with gastric juices, similar to Sir Stroming. Oh well, all that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's why I waited until you woke up. I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. So, you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Of course. Then it's a deal. 
As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. I may even add additional selections in time. I look forward to your continued patronage. Considering all the actions you've taken, you must have had someone with medical expertise. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. I am the... It shall become the... With the birth of the death persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. So, when can you come back for the next clinical trial? Oh, you don't remember that part either? Well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. So, I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. I have to perfect this medicine. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right, take care. Fine by me. All right, take care. Hey. Our school years divided. So that tell you what, let's just go ahead and fully solve it. I don't know if we have to. But uh final result. So I know we need an S to finish this. All right. I see. Nice. Like, do we get more for fully solving it? Let's go clean our room. Hey. Oh. Oh. Nice. Okay. Got 
that's social thought. Yoncha Walker 04. Yeah. Mm. Well then. We can't even activate our DVD player. <laughs> Come on. This sucks. <laughs> nice. Books are great. Oh. Try to answer this. They're the same. Is it? You Pay do no attention to that asterisks that, uh, <laughs> whatchamacallit, may or may not indicate some modifications of some game files. Got more knowledge. I see. I'm still in the classroom. Haven't decided. Unfortunately, we do not have a chariot persona, I think. Uh, but we're just gonna have to roll with that. We don't have mm. the compendium or the velvet room yet. So the thing I downloaded is supposed to also give me a cheat sheet for the <laughs> confidant answers, but it isn't for some reason. Uh, so I may have to look into that. For now, my guide does have the dialogue choices. All right. 
it. See ya. Never too late. something here mm. I've got a good idea should be able to okay so we can train so basically we have something we can do for probably all of our stats here uh, but today we're gonna Heal our plant with bio-nutrients. Oh, yeah. Oh. Improve our kindness. Yes. I'll just add this. I'm gonna go ahead and save, and then we're gonna keep crafting lockpicks over and over again and reloading if we don't okay. get a chance to do a second one. I'm going to reload. Hmm? I'm just going to fast forward through it. Uh. I'm going to fast forward because we're going to just reload our save. It's going to be annoying if we have to do this, like, multiple times. We did already start with a bunch of lockpicks, okay. so maybe we don't need them, but... Yeah. <laughs> Aha! Yes. We did it on the second try! <laughs> That's good. And we got a bonus proficiency point. Well, yeah, I think between streams, I'm going to look into uh, some additional mods we can install. Hey. I'm going to read Pirate Legend. I won't fast forward mm -hmm. this time.
Okay. Let's go to the hideout. I hope you all understand that our time limit is May 2nd. We basically just have to go to that castle and steal the treasure from Kamoshida, right? But wait, what even is a treasure? I want to know that before we do anything. A treasure is the physical form of the palace ruler's distorted desires. In other words, it's the core of the palace. Once we steal it, the palace will crumble. I think, having said all that, even I don't know what Kamoshida's treasure is going to be. And where can we find it? There's no way of knowing that until but if I had to guess. I'd say he has it locked. Uh, I think I get it now. Pretty much. There's just a lot we will in any case. I'll make sure we go about this with time to spare. So I expect great. All right. I'm going to so bust infiltrate loose. the palace. I was just thinking we should choose a code name for you too. A code name? I'm Skull, he's Joker, and that's Mona. Judging by your costume. I mean, she's got that tail and stuff, so what do you think? Go with cat girl. Wait! Is that what you're going to call me from now on? I am so not down with this. What do you want to be called then? Um, something better than just a little cat. Maybe... Panther? That sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? Huh? Why? Cause it sounds more... ferocious? She's a cougar. Don't call me that! More importantly, Kamoshida. Oh, right. Let's go. Let's start fresh and get going. It's game time from this point forward. I'll teach you guys the basics of infiltration. My master would like a word with you. Now we get the, the tutorial. Well done. It seems you have remembered my words. You truly make it worth rehabilitating you. What's that mean? <laughs> I am not attempting to withhold information from you. The essence of the rehabilitation that you must complete will be explained in due time. Once you encounter allies who share your ideals and discover your place in reality, only then will I explain it all. Such a day should not be far off. This time, I wish to introduce you to the aid we are providing. Oh, Due to your potential in wielding the power of the wild card, you can handle more than one persona. That power holds infinite possibilities. We will assist you in nurturing that potential. To that end, we must execute your persona. <laughs> Do not be alarmed. Personas are personalities that exist within you. Thus, you will only be discarding old personalities to have them be reborn as new ones. By discarding your old identity, you give way to a new one. Hence, we call that process execution. Think of it as the fusion of your personas. To start, select the first persona you wish to fuse. Now, before you select the second persona, allow me to tell you something greatly important. Do you remember how I mentioned forming bonds with confidants? Personas are the power of the heart. The stronger those bonds, the stronger your personas will be. 
In other words, the effects of your bonds on execution, or fusion, if you will, are quite substantial. When you fuse a persona, this will be a guiding principle. Moreover, there is one thing I must warn you about. You cannot create a persona that surpasses your current level. This is because the resulting persona would be too powerful for you to handle effectively. Now then, check the fusion results. Well, we only have one choice. This is the form your new persona is expected to take after fusion. It's possible for them to inherit skills they normally wouldn't gain. These skills and specialties are distinct from one another. Skills are... Select the skills you'd like to inherit. It will uh, receive a fraction of power. My, my. <laughs> I am Arsene, the other you who exists within. Though I may disappear this moment, I shall always be at your side. We shall meet again. When your fate reaches its conclusion. <laughs> Interesting, I guess there's like a special cutscene if you fuse away Arsene. Chariot Persona. We're gonna need, according to this guide, we're gonna need uh, Pixie back. A stronger persona. It's worth will be and we're gonna need Barret to battle. and Mandrake as well. Gather personas and bring them here. Gather a great many. Execute them and continue to give birth to even stronger personas. Developing your powers as such will play an integral role in the stand against ruin. So that your rehabilitation goes well. And depending on the effort you put in, arm cry your tears of. Your heart is steadily. It seems your rehabilitation is. In anticipation of this. Thief skill, allowing what I believe you can handle. Oh, we got now. Batman vision. May you continue devoting yourself. Now then, do we have access to the compendium yet? It's me. How fair, Justine? You handle this. Read here. Ooh. <laughs> we can just summon a level 76 persona for free? That seems too good. I think I'm going to avoid doing that. For now, I'll just what summon back Pixie. Then accept this persona. Like, if we wanted to, <laughs> we could... Get all of these for free! Like, these are crazy! They just give you these! I think I'm gonna set myself like a hard rule that I am only going to summon these when we are like at the appropriate level to use what? them. It is time, inmate. Something wrong? You were just... Why are you spacing out like that? 
Let's just say we're counting on. So for now, I'm just gonna focus so, on like recruiting personas. Let's head to the safe room we found last time. That's pretty close to our usual entrance. Safe room? It'll make sense when you see. So I know technically we can uh, just jump straight to the safe room, but I actually do want to like explore and like gather stuff if possible. There's nothing to gather in that room now. I'll reveal your Who true you? form. Now's our chance to strike. Let's go. go. Pixie. There. Ooh, looking cool, Joker. Come. Go down. I would like to talk. Yeah, fine. Give me a break. It's not like that. Hey now. You tempt people. We got bicorn. You've got a new mask, Joker. So we only get two right. experience. Really wish we could like hide behind these pillars. True form. I want to get these like everything down to zero. Don't move now. Just go ahead and I'll attack. Good job, us. Okay. Didn't even break a sweat. Okay. Three enemies. Let's do it. Ah, uh, the problem here is we are too strong to recruit. Pyro Jack or Jack of Lantern, whichever name they decided to give him for this one. All right. Ha! Piece of kit. I'll reveal your true form. Ooh, Mandrakes. Just 
Good. Hey, we're at zero uh, stuff. That's oh. good. Well. Oh. I guess let's go to the velvet room early and often because like what if we need to get rid of a persona do you need something like especially because everything we have right now is an arcana we want to have i mean maybe bicorn isn't one we need but let's see Justine, register you have registration register are you sure Read here. So we've got. We have no need to summon our sen. I'm not worried about that. So we've got lovers. We've got chariot. We've got a hermit persona. Hermit has not come up for us yet. And we've got a mandrake. Let's just continue exploring for now, and we will worry about. What we can make, finished? like what? it is time, inmate. Now then, what do we do from here? All right. So now we explore. Smoke screen, a vanish ball, and like combat items. Focus. Ooh. I do like the like stealth game mechanics involved here. Oh, I guess I should just like use my gun to clear combat because it's free. I can see what some people were saying online now about the guns being too good. I might even contemplate. If I can find a mod where I can, like, 
make gun ammo stop replenishing after every combat. I may end up doing that. Ah. That thing. Now then. A baton pass. I'll reveal your true you. form. Opportunity to baton pass and swap your turn. Pass to Ryuji. He gets a free spell that does big damage. And we'll just all out attack this. Steel. We should be taking everything that's not tied down, is the way I look at it. Somewhere. Finally, use cover. I'll reveal your true form. I've been waiting for this moment. Now's our chance to strike. Ha, 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 ha. Like it opens. Let's I try somewhere else. It. Show me your true you? form. So good. We've actually used it yet. Ooh, that's a good gun. <laughs> Honestly, like, there's a part of me that doesn't know how to feel about okay. the gun changes. Because one thing I will say I remember is that I never used On's gun in the original release of 5, unless I was just, like, out of ammo for everyone else. Because, um... 
Like, because she uses it so, like, unpredictably, you can't just, like... I don't know what the word I'm Joker. looking for is. How suspicious. Hey, we got a castle map. Hmm. Now then. Want to get going? I'll reveal your true form. Not over yet. Yeah, this definitely seems a little too easy. <laughs> Maybe I should have gone to like hard difficulty or something. With this power. Seems like the windows have something going on, but I don't know if that's just. I'll reveal your true form. Yeah, I think that's just a like special effect. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. Huh? Somewhere. That was a little too easy. Yeah, I think part of the problem is that guns, like, in the original release were probably oh, balanced yes. around the fact that you had to conserve your ammo. And now that we don't have to do that, there's just kind of no... purpose I guess okay I think this is like the way we actually have to go so I kind of want to explore a little more on this floor first what you need to train more I have something because there actually wasn't that much to look around This way, this way. This way. I'm just double checking that I'm not missing anything as we go. Hmm? Oh, this feeling. Maybe there's a safe room. Oh. What do we got? Night watch armor. 
How did that look on us? Pretty good, I would say. So we found a safe room. A safe room! Let's do it. Uh, thinking... I'll just add this. Yeah, we haven't done enough that I feel like Let's I need it. to go back. Uh, I actually might call it like 15 minutes early here. Uh, just because this is going to be the best stopping place in the next, you know, 10 minutes here, basically. And uh, I got other stuff I got to do tonight before I go to sleep. So I think I should call it now. Uh, thank you, uh, everybody who stopped by. Uh, I will be back possibly this weekend if i am gonna stream this weekend it'll be on sunday uh, and we'll get back to cult of the lamb on sunday uh last weekend where we started playing this was kind of a special occurrence uh otherwise we are making our way through this at our usual tuesday time from now on and uh yeah between streams, I will look into uh, more mods to kind of make this a little more smooth. You know, less of me checking other websites and resources, ideally, make it a more self-contained experience. But I will let you know how that goes. And until then, uh, quit from them. Yeah, uh, I will talk to you this weekend, and if not this weekend, I will talk to you uh, on Tuesday.